In this presentation, we are going to be talking about the steps of the water cycle, precipitation, collection, evaporation, and condensation. Precipitation is when any form of water, like rain, snow, sleet, or hail, falls to the Earth's surface. I started with precipitation because that's what we're all used to. We're used to the rain and the snow and the things that fall from the sky and come down to the Earth's surface. Collection refers to the process by which that water gathers back into bodies of water, like rivers, lakes, oceans, and big puddles. Evaporation is when liquid becomes a gas without forming bubbles inside the liquid volume. Um, it looks as if it disappears. Bubbles are formed, then we're talking about boiling water. This isn't boiling water. It's just evaporation. It looks like the water disappears when it becomes a gas. Condensation is the final process. This is the process by which water vapor in the air is changed into liquid water. Like when water vapor from your hot shower cools when it meets the surface of the cold bathroom mirror and leaves a fog. The water vapor in the air collects to become clouds. The water in the clouds eventually becomes heavy enough to fall back to the earth as precipitation and the water cycle starts again. Precipitation, collection, evaporation, and condensation. Created using Powtoon.